Hi there, and for this video, we're going to show you how to log in with a password on Udemy. Now, with all platforms, logging in with your password is usually a simple step that we always do every time. However, some platforms may be an exception. And right now, we're going to talk about Udemy. Right now, we're here on the Udemy's homepage. Let's say I want to log in. We have to go to the top right and click on log in. Now, once here, you can enter the email that you use to sign up, but there are other options on how you can log in. In my case, these three are the available options. And let me clarify that even if you type in a Gmail on this prompt here, if you signed up this same email, but through this button right here with this prompt, that is a different thing. That issue happened to me with another platform, but if it is happening to you on Udemy, that might be the case. Even if the Gmail is the same, you will have to try logging in through this button right here and also typing it down here. But let's say I will enter through here. Now I will click continue with email. And as you can see, it is a passwordless login that will instead send a six digit code to this email that I have provided. So I will simply paste the six digit code over here and click on log in. Now, if your situation is that you want to log in with a password, but have the option to log in with a six digit code, then all we have to do is go over to the top right to our profile and look down a bit, go to account settings, and here we can enter a new password. And in this case, Google has created its own password. And because there is passwordless login, let's say you have trouble logging in in the first place. So let me just log out. All right, we have successfully logged out. Now it may just be a case of what I've explained earlier, but if you still have trouble logging in, but you do have an account, we have to scroll down. And over here on the very bottom left-hand side of the site, you can see Discover Udemy and where you have to go is help and support. Now, either you are a learner or an instructor, but where you have to go is down here and you can either click on account and profile or trust and safety. And if you are on the phone, maybe you can go for mobile as well. And on the very general, you can click on troubleshooting. Of course, you can click on any of these options and you will still end up with an actual person. But to have a smoother flow with a support desk, these two are where I would personally click if I have trouble logging into my account. Still, I hope this video was helpful. If it was, please leave a like, maybe subscribe and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any of our new videos. Thank you for watching and see you again next time.